Big Cinema here, and this is my roommate. I am the roommate, and this is Raven. Yes, hi Raven, yes, so. She'll be appearing periodically because, well, she has problems listening to the words today. <laughs> yep. Don't you? Yep. Yes, you do. Yes, so when the big old pandemic thingy started, uh, and I had some time off of work, I started this channel to do like video essays and reviews and oh, such. Okay. And then, after a while, I had time off, I noticed there were a lot of, like, reaction videos and such on the YouTube. And I very much enjoy watching reaction videos, so I figured, hey, I could do that. I've only, I've seen practically a lot of the cool stuff that's worth reacting to, so. But however... Seriously, the amount of movies you've seen? Like, yeah. if you could see our DVD cabinet. Yes. Holy crap. However, I have a roommate who hasn't seen a lot of stuff. Magically. Especially... Somehow. Especially in the horror category. Yeah, that's a little less yeah. surprising. And she is somebody who, as she describes herself as being a total wuss when it comes to watching, and she will freak out. And I'm like, you know what? You'd be great for reacting to, or having reaction videos and such, so. Don't do that to me in a back alley, but yeah. you put it on a TV screen, man. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so, this will be our first video we'll be doing, okay? And the very first video we're going to do, since Betty White just sadly recently passed this past uh, New Year's Sad Eve, icon. we're going to be reacting to Lake Placid. She has never seen Lake Placid. And yep. I figured I'll start with one that's, you know, horror s but has a good bit of comedy, so it won't freak you out too much. No, but, not too much. I only leave in a few weeks to go to where the gators roam. Yeah, but it's okay. We'll do a lot of these before you go <laughs> so I can stagger out my releases. So, uh, that'll be good. And also, um, we'll start off, you know, pretty easy with this. But uh, after this, I'm going to I'm gonna really hit you hard with some of the more gruesome stuff. Yeah, act like Things I know you get freaked time. out with. Like, I already know what I have planned for you. I'm getting her watching The Thing. I'm going to have her watch... Um, uh, Hellraiser, one of my favorites. Oh, we're, we're actually going to Hell... Wow. We're going to Hellraiser. This is the one in the past that he said yeah. I was not... I shouldn't watch. <laughs> you would... Because you freak out a lot. I do. You do. I do. Yes, you do. Yeah. That's why this is going to be fun, because they can see you freak out. <laughs> so, yes. So, we will be watching Lake Placid. It's got Betty White in it. It's got other people as well. Oh, it has Oliver Platt? When did this thing come out? It came out in like ninety nine. Huh. Well, yeah. That's fun. Richard Fonda, Bill Paxton. Or no, not Bill Paxton, Bill Pullman. I always get those two mixed up every now and again. Does say Bill Pullman? Where Bill Pullman, Pullman, yes. The president from Independence Day. Ah uh, hey. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, he's on the back. Yeah, he is in this. So There are other pictures on the back, and I think you should just take this now. <laughs> It's okay, we're going to see more pictures here in a oh, moment. Oh, yeah, I'd hope so, because otherwise something's wrong with that TV, and we have bigger problems at hand. <laughs> Alright, so, we're going to get going to watching this, and, um... Yeah, here goes nothing. Here we go. See, now on the downside for him here, is that if I freak out, he is the closest thing to being a space dummy. So we have, because he can't do that to the dog. She gets sad and yelps and makes me feel like a crappy dog mom. Uh-huh. Is that with you? Yep. It's okay. Almost pulled out his hair a couple times. <laughs> this takes place in Maine. There's a gator in Maine? Yeah, surprisingly. Maybe they'll talk about it in the movie. I like to give these one word sarcastic answers. Gee. You recognize him from Harry Potter. Ask me when an animal does it. Ah! I was gonna say I knew that face. As long as he doesn't do it to man. That happens to me way too often. I think Mark Twain said that. Thank you for not letting it bother me. Yeah, I think you did. My bad itch. I'm assuming he's going to even be our first victim, or at least stumble upon the fact that a gator exists. My money's on first victim. Yeah, you gotta have somebody getting it first off in the opening of these movies. He's a good candidate. Because you got the guy up in the boat who can survive. He's like, oh my god! Yeah. Yeah. Like, turtle! Turtle. I love turtles. Shut up. I 
said nothing. For the looks that was enough, it was loud. You know, it would be a real twist if this was actually the first victim. His boat is sinking real low in the water, and that- because she's fat. You only got babies? You're gonna ruin it before I get to see baby beavers? I hear the music. <laughs> Fuck you. Oh, no, see, he's the first victim. It's looking like that. Oh, and of course the cop guy doesn't notice. Come on, save him. This is why they don't like county sheriffs. It's because you are not observant. Help him, you idiot. Call for a, yeah, that's it. Grab a pedal. That's helpful. He grabbed something. He could have grabbed a radio. Radio for help, anything. That would not be floating. I saw a teeth. I saw teeth and blood and teeth. Oh, God! Oh. Ugh. He's just half the man he used to be. Looks like he was the first victim. Yeah. It's okay, she comforts us. Yeah, she tries. It's more like she asks for comfort and destruction. <laughs> Panic attack? What are you doing? Yeah, I mean, you're meditating. Uh, you're sure you're Lamaze and giving birth. The brunette. If you're yeah. upset, long, deep breaths. What, Mershka Haggerty? Mershka Haggerty? Uh, she's the female lead on Law and Order SVU. I, I sort of had yes, uh, that's inside definitely information. I know that voice. That is definitely her. The heart wants what the heart wants. Yeah, you just sound like a bitch. The genitals want what the genitals want. That's what it sounds more like. Yeah. Probably a fever then. Yeah, you know that. Why would movie am I picturing right now? Casper. Yes. Well, it's not a shark. You definitely don't find sharks in life. Is that the way it came out of the water? Jaws is right now. Hey, Kevin, what's going on? What's happening? How's it going? How's your family? Good? It's great. It's so nice to see you. Fuck off. This is business. <laughs> there was an accident in Maine. Some guy got killed by something in a lake. Or I recognize maybe a dinosaur. Oh, well, I'm sure that that's what amazing. it was. He was killed by a dinosaur. Is there anything else? Gators are dinosaurs! I uh, want you to go there. What? It, it's probably no, nothing, they, they but you're a paleontologist. This is what we do. What do you mean, this is what we do? I'd like you to check out this tooth. You want me to go to Maine to look at a tooth? No, you just want time with your Oh, brother. this was Myra's idea, wasn't it? Oh. Oh, of course. Oh, that's a yes. That's, that's a yes. Wait till I cool off. It has nothing to do with that. I don't do it's just a bonus. I did. Maine? The lake was calm until up it came. The tooth is in here. Well, that's that's the mark. Yes. yes. You can read. Well, the, is the dead guy in there? In the morgue? That's where they keep them. What? Well, maybe, yeah. Surely. Look, you want me to bring the tooth out of here? No. No, let's... You. <laughs> Strong, independent woman. Maybe I should see. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. can deal with dead men. Bodies. Can you deal with half of them? <gasps> yeah, that's what I thought. What is that? Lightweight forward area air device unit. Whatever's out there, one shot the business is dead. It's a BFG. Why exactly would you have that? God. Because they run into bears. Often. It's made and Mosquitoes, I got a thing about mosquitoes. Uh, some museum sent you, huh? What, are we all museum bigots in Maine? She's rude, sarcastic. You two should get along. I'm afraid I can't let you go with us, ma'am. Yes, I know that. It's not a science trip. Could you be a little more condescending? Because I'm not real great with subtlety. <laughs> we heard a man was bit in half. Oh, well, there was an accident, that's all. It's nothing to worry about. Yeah, but yeah. you have a chance. 
You were staring at her with way too much luxury oh, for that. Oh, well, her husband passed away. It's been almost Betty. two years now. Incomplete records haunt me so. What was the cause of your husband's death, ma'am? Do you know? We don't need to invade your privacy, but was he ill? Was he sick? Was he swallowed? Sheriff. Uh, Mrs. Graham. <laughs> That's the reason why we're here. A man was... Do you know how your husband died? Oh, yes. I killed him. You killed him? Oh, yes. Uh, and how would you have accomplished this, then? Half mile up, there's a clearing. Two days and half the camp. Yes, camp. But I thought that meant Ramada Inn. I, I never heard tents. God. Will there be oh toilets? Seriously. We should just take you back. Why? Because I prefer a toilet. Oh, God, we forgot to pack the feminine napkins. Oh, so you're with him now. Are you taking his side? I didn't say a word. Oh, well, a branch. It's what's what's left of the moose? You threw it at me! I just let go of it! You threw it at me! Oh you my god, it? you are such a whiny oh, little thing! Quit slapping him! Don't That's rude! Throw heads at me! Stop calling me ma'am! She seems very on edge. That's great! Oh, they just want someone out of the water! Back away from sure. it if you don't want it to touch you! How many deputies you got? And all I want to know is how the hell did it get a moose? Here. I don't care how much money. Expect a quick response if he hears that. 
Adult You're gonna go in there in a wetsuit? Are you fucking stupid? Again, I don't mean to be annoying with my questions, but if it is a crocodile, which I don't think it is, they do charge these baby hatchling sounds. Why exactly would you want to be underwater at the time? With you, it makes sense. Would you mind putting down the anchor? I brought a pork chop for luck. Maybe you could hang it around your neck. That's sweet. Maybe later you could chew the bark off my big fat log. Was that like a homosexual remark? Yes. I believe it was. Yes, that was a dick joke.
Mm -hmm. We should go to uh, mm -hmm. yeah. rest. We should go to our separate tents and, uh, and yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. get some uh -huh. gold. Uh -huh. Otherwise, that's one of the weirdest pickup lines I've ever heard. We should go to that. Uh, yeah. Thanks for the bandage. Oh, that's a big old take a print. print. You'd hunt it down and kill it, which seems to be exactly what you're trying to do. How long have it you been killed two thing? people? Six years. Six years? You just appeared. You have no idea how you arrived here. No, do you? Well, your husband burned you. You didn't by any chance lead him to the lake blindfolded. If I had a dick, this is where I'd tell you to suck it. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> I'll kill your husband. Yes. That's why. You're under full house arrest. Thank you. Officer, fuck meat. Here, we got a problem with Hector. Probably just me. That doesn't mean shit. That thing's the size of my car. You know, it would be a better story if it didn't actually hurt him. It was like Damn. 
wrap things up with my romantic interest. Yeah. I'll go. Then just to offend you in principle. Now she's flirty. No, no, that's that's all right. I'm gonna be a little while anyway. I want to. Go say goodbye to the lake. You sure? Because, uh... That's where you find out no, there's I, a third dater! I want to stay a little longer. You didn't regret that. Nope, get out of the car. So does nobody ever make a move in Maine? <laughs> Why do I feel like she's about to meet the third crocodile? Little buttons. Now, babies. Oh, babies. I knew it. Yeah. Just... Yeah. 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 Ever that you get eaten by a gator or a crocodile. This is why we don't let you go swimming in Florida. No. Yes, I know. You're a good girl. <laughs> Alright, so that was Lake Placid. What you think? I think my fear of water is deepening. <laughs> Well, gate, and I think I will never go scuba diving ever. Well, the croc can come on land, so it's not just going to get you in the water. Which helps nothing. <laughs> Absolutely nothing. You know, I used to like lakes. Mm -hmm. I might be changing my opinions. Mm -hmm. Yes. Between yes. the bull sharks and this, 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 no. The Asian no, croc. You don't like raised by Betty White. Either. Yes. Betty White loved animals. That's actually the perfect way to picture her. Betty White loved animals. She did. And here she is nurturing some crocs and scratching them under their little chin. <laughs> Go freaking figure. Yeah. That, yeah, this first real movie I saw with Betty White featured, and she was her glorious self. <laughs> Favorite line. If I had a dick, this is why I tell you to suck it. <laughs> that was a great, great lie. And I think the only thing I regret about it is that she said it as a script in a movie and not in real life to somebody. Oh, probably when somebody deserved it, she probably pulled that, you know, right out of her back pocket. I would. Ready to go. I would. <laughs> Left, right, and freaking side. I may do that. Yes. Mm -hmm. So, how would you... Uh, rated if we could rate it because some oh. reactors will rate their okay. movies. Um, Whatever scale you want. It definitely had more action filmy feel. It was a little more along the lines of Jurassic Park for me. Yes, scary stuff but adventure but elements and good characters. gory. Yes. It literally bit someone's It did show a lot more gore than Jurassic Park did. And literally bit someone in half. Mm-hmm. Um, so yeah, that that's are we doing like on that one to ten scale is scary and like you know one being a hocus pocus and <laughs> ten being actually you would have to place ten because I don't know if the scariest would okay ten would be like for me arachnophobia arachnophobia because you're you're fuck scared of spiders yes yeah that is one movie you may not see us ever do she's already seen it I've seen it so it's the reason I'm scared of spiders yes yeah. the one movie she would hasn't seen but refuses to absolutely watch is eight-legged freaks yeah but it's so fun i love it her. she is so <sighs> pissed scared of spiders but I listen do... listen i have gotten a lot better than i used to be all right she... ones like this big used to make me paralytically in fear couldn't move had to get someone else to either move me or move it i bet one's as big as a kitchen table did I ever tell you about the time at the haunt I used to work at where the guy in charge asked me to spider web the bug house before we had Trans World come through? Oh. Yeah, right, I um... had to be rescued because <laughs> I was on the floor crying, unable to move. Oh, it didn't help that there were no lights and it was dark. <laughs> Let's just add that in. Yeah. 
and I, yeah, it was bad. It was really, really, really bad, and I am still really, really grateful so, that I got rescued. <laughs> so yeah, we won't be doing eight-legged freaks anytime soon. However, yeah. if we get a crap ton of subscribers, more than my current 68 or so that I have. He might uh, twist my arm. Yeah, like, you know, you just You better be ready incentive. to like lose limbs that night, I'm just yeah. saying, because I'm gonna be grabbing more than your arm. Yeah, if we can get up to, I'd say, 100,000 subscribers, which uh, would be amazing, but, you know, you never know, then I'd be like, okay, Maybe. they saw our first video, they saw that we promised Eight-Legged Freaks for you, if we got 100,000, you'd be willing to watch that. I might need alcohol that night. <laughs> you can drink whatever you want, as long as... <laughs> Don't worry! You watch it. I'll still be very lucid, because when I drink, I turn into a five-year-old... I mean, it's going to be similar in vain to Lake Plaza. It's it's more fun and adventure. It's just got more than one giant <laughs> killer creature. Because spiders multiply way... Actually, no, they multiply about the same as crocodiles, too. Because they lay a bunch of eggs at the same time. And then they grow. Mm -hmm. I think they lay more eggs than gators, though. Or crocodiles, because I'm pretty sure they're on the same wavelength there. Yeah. Like, I think they lay about, like, 10, 15 little babies. I could look that up. I'm not going to, but I could. Okay. And spiders lay hundreds of thousands of eggs at a, at a time, which is so much worse. I think if a eight-legged freaks actually did happen, I would just off myself at the beginning of that and just say, you know what? <laughs> nope, it's not worth it anymore. Mm -mm. Yeah. So We're in the now. far off future, that could be done sometime. Possibly. The next one we do, though, um, We've already decided. I've, I've decided it's going to be... He's deciding all of the movies. Yeah. I am leaving that solely in his Yes, control. I'm using a guide for Bravo's list of 100 scariest movie moments right now because I saw that special back yeah. in 2004 in the first year, and that's what really got me into horror and all the different types. Um, so we've already seen, like, like the top 20 films, of like, like, about 10 of them. And let's be fair. And, but there are ones left we should still she should see. That also has things like Willy Wonka and the Chocolate Factory. It's scary it. movie moments, not... Scariest horror movies. And The Wizard of Oz. That was very So I feel like moment. those were yeah. unavoidable at this point. Like, there's no way I was going to just not see any movie on that list. Yeah, but there will be movies that are still so. worth watching that are Definitely. very are horror plenty, specific. Plenty on there that I have not seen. Was this on the list? I don't think it was. I do not believe it was on the list. This was a special first time viewing for us because of Betty White. Yeah, that's kind of what I was going That's with why I, I started with curious. this instead of the really intense shit, which I'm going to start to throw at you. Yeah, my brain's going to be melting out of my ears. Yeah. So the next one we watch will be The Thing. Um, any final thoughts for Lake Placid? Um, check with your local fish and wildlife before go swimming in lakes. <laughs> mm. Or just don't. Just don't. Yeah. Nope, those are my final thoughts. Final thoughts. Oh, that and Betty White is incomparable. Mm. And I think it is adorable that she had her own little farm there. Yeah. Yeah. We love Betty White. Who doesn't love Betty White? I mean, seriously. When you die at 99 and they think it's too soon, you know you did something right. You do. She did a lot of things right. Mm -hmm. All of things right. <laughs> No one has anything bad to say about her, ever. No. Okay, so that was our reaction. First time for her for Lake Placid. And um, we hope you enjoyed that, and we'll see you for the next one. Right. Yep.